G'day everyone, welcome back to the channel. It is The Little Aussie Collector, and today we're happy to announce that we have got our Pennywise 2.0 Blue Box Hyper life-size bust in the building. It arrived uh, yesterday afternoon, and I couldn't wait to throw him up on the review table for you guys to have a look. Um, this is edition number two of 60. So I assume that they will start shipping out if you've got this on order. No doubt you've clicked on this video eagerly to have a look at what we think. But uh, if you have ordered this without um, giving you a spoiler or anything like that, you're going to be more than happy. So let's dive into the 2.0 version of Pennywise from Blue Box Hyper. Uh, and let us know what you think in the comments and um, dive in. So as we can see, it is a mixed media bust. It's quite sizable actually with the uh, shoulders. If you puff them out, as you do there, it ends up being about 70 centimeters wide, which is um, pretty wide for a bust. And it's around that same height and 70 centimeters in, in uh, height as well. Now this is uh, one of their busts that they actually have done a base for. Many uh, of their other statues, early days from Blue Box, they didn't do a base, but their first version uh, also, which was a, a very low edition size of just 30, they didn't do a base. So it was nice that they put some stairs in here for us and they gave us a uh, sort of like a blood-stained nameplate. So not necessary to display. You can simply just remove that if you wish, obviously, but uh, I think I'll just keep it there. But we're not here to see the nameplate, are we? We want to see the portrait. That's what you're buying a blue box hyper bust for, is that silicon portrait. So let's have a look. And again, magnificent. Fantastic. So the open mouth here from the uh, famous projector scene in It. And it is done very, very, very well. The teeth are great. They've got this wet look to them. Uh, the mouth itself, the shape of the mouth is done very well with the nose, uh, iconic eyes, of course his left eye being wonky, and a nice expression with that forehead, so the forehead and sort of like frowning. And one of the uh, key features of the Pennywise bust is that scarring or those um, on the top of his forehead there. He's got some cuts and um, cracks and um, they're displayed very well as it was with their first bust. So if you've got their first bust, you'll know what type of quality that you're getting here. If you haven't seen that first bust in person in particular, um, then yeah, it's kind of hard to describe, but it's done very, very, very well. So I know there are many Pennywise busts out on the market. I know ECC did a very good one. Um, the issue there a bit with the hair, a little bit uh, difficult to style. This hair in particular was taken straight out of the box. It's, um, I haven't played with the hair at all, so I'm gonna fluff it up a little bit on the sides, but that little um, part that he's got at the top of his head there, that's done already from the styling team at Blue Box, and that comes straight out of the box, so I haven't had to do too much to it at all. It's permanently fixed in the base, so it's not a two-part bust or anything it's just a one-parter so very very easy to take out of the box straightforward setup so let's get you a couple of close-ins here of the portrait that's what everyone wants to see okay so let's dive in here and I'll try and get some nice footage there of how we can see of his cracks here on his forehead They've done very well, exceptional job there. And the eyes, colouring, expression down to the nose and the teeth, that real wet look. So done really well. Now it does have a light up feature. So we will put that on in a second and it gives it that real menacing look there in the evening. I had it on last night, it was fantastic. So what does everyone think? Pennywise 2.0, if you're a horror collector, if you're a horror bust collector, 
Is this the best Pennywise bust out there? Well, it's got to be up there. It's either this one or the first one. And I think if you've got either version, you'd be a very happy camper. If you've got both, then you're doing great. But um, yeah, I think if you had either version, you, you're uh, doing a great job. Let's put the uh, eyes on for you to have a look. Now, there's a simple switch at the back, which takes a couple of AA batteries. And there we can see yeah, it's quite a, a bright day here in Melbourne. So we just pan away. It's done very well. So there we have it guys, the uh, Pennywise 2.0. What are we thinking? Me, I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. It's definitely a 9.5 out of 10 bust for me. Um, fantastic. Clothing's done well. No, um, no complaints about that. It's quite frilly, which is what we want. Uh, really simple design with it. Portrait is killer. Very good portrait. Hairstyling's done really well. And the hair itself's nice as well. Um, the ears are great. The eyelashes are fantastic in the eyes. Uh, teeth, a knockout. Can't fault it too much at all, guys. This is fantastic. This is going in the collection right next to the Valic 2.0 that we've got. So that horror collection is um, really growing now. We're up to about 10 really iconic busts. So very happy with it. It's gonna stay in the collection. I'm gonna put him in there later on this afternoon. Yeah. All right, guys, um, hit that, smash that like button for us. It really helps the channel a lot. I hope you enjoyed the video. I know there was a, a video from Virtual Devil who was out a month or two ago, and that was one of his friends busts with it. So I think this is the uh, first bust uh, in hand other than that video, which is good. So I really hope you enjoyed the footage here today I uh, Appreciate it. If you throw us a like in there. That'd be great really pumping up towards that thousand subscriber list, which is awesome So stay tuned for more videos coming up soon But in the meantime, I hope you have a great day everyone and Pennywise is out